I recreated WrestleMania 37 in WWE 2K20. We're gonna find out what happens. So what I've done is I've downloaded wrestlers that aren't in the game and I've put them in the game so I can recreate all the matches. Now, WrestleMania hasn't happened yet, but by the time you see this video, it probably will have happened. So this is just my prediction video. I'll probably do another video to see how accurate it was. Now, I'm not going to show every single match. I might show the main event at the end a little bit. I'm gonna simulate everything, but we'll probably watch the world title match, the triple threat match. I think that'll be interesting to watch. So why don't we get started? Now, I don't know what order the matches are going to happen on the actual WrestleMania itself, but here, I just put them together. I split them between day one and day two. We know which ones are gonna happen on day one, which ones are gonna happen on day two. So we're just gonna go ahead and simulate, so let's do it. So our first match is gonna be Bad Bunny and Damian Priest versus The Miz and John Morrison. So I think that Bad Bunny and Damian Priest are probably gonna win this match in real life. Let's see what WWE 2K20 has to say about it. And it looks like The Miz and Morrison are the winners. I know you can't see behind my head, but that's, that's what's happening right now. The Miz and Morrison have won that match. I don't think that's really going to happen, but that's what WWE 2K20 says, so let's see if it's true. All right, our second match is Seth Rollins versus Cesaro. If I was going to make a prediction, I think that Seth Rollins is probably going to win this match in real life. Let's see what happens. And it looks like Cesaro won. Uh, it's possible Cesaro's going to win. I mean, honestly, this one's going to be a toss-up. It could be either one in this one. I'm really looking forward to it. All right, next we have Braun Strowman and Shane McMahon in a steel cage match. Again, I don't know how this one's going to play out. These ones play out so crazily every time they have them. It's apparently a Brains versus Braun match. So let's hit that simulate button, see what happens. And it looks like Braun Strowman wins. Now, when it comes down to pure Braun, Braun Strowman's got it. But Shane McMahon, I mean, he knows how to get out of sticky situations. He's been in matches like this before, and he's come out on top. So who knows what's going to happen. All right, next we have the Fatal 4-Way Tag Team Match between the Riot Squad, Dana Brooke and Mandy Rose, Lana and Naomi, and Natalya and Tamina. So let's see who's supposed to come out on top on this one and face Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler. It looks like Lana and Naomi won, so they're gonna be facing Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler later on. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to finish WrestleMania and then I'll make a Raw where I'll just make that one match and then we'll hit the simulate button and see what happens. All right, the next match we have is a tag team title match between The New Day and AJ Styles and Omo. Now this one could really go either way. Never seen Omos wrestle, but I know he's a powerhouse and he's taken out The New Day on multiple occasions. So let's see what the game has to say. The game thinks Omos and AJ Styles are gonna win those tag team titles. So who knows? I think it might happen. All right, our next match is the women's title match, Bianca Belair versus Sasha Banks. This rivalry's been growing for a while. They both have big egos. I think Sasha Banks has probably a bigger ego than Bianca Belair, but Bianca Belair, Sasha Banks, they're both great. So let's see what the game has to say. This could really go either way. That looks like Sasha Banks is gonna retain her title. That's what the game says. We'll find out. I'm actually, in real life, I'm rooting for Bianca. I think I want her to pull this one off. All right, next we got Drew McIntyre versus Bobby Lashley. Now, this one could really go either way either, and this one is gonna be a really good match. They're both really good, they hit hard, they don't hold back. I'm really looking forward to this one in real life. Let's see what the game has to say. And it looks like Bobby Lashley is set to retain his title. Who knows? It could happen. I think I think Bobby Lashley is going to retain just for the simple fact that he started his new thing. I think he should stay champion for at least a few more months, maybe up to a year. Who knows? I could see him dominating for that long. He is that good. All right, now we're starting day two of WrestleMania. I started off with the Randy Orton versus The Fiend match. I don't know what to expect from this one. This one's going to be odd. I probably should have put Alexa Bliss in The Fiend's corner, but it's too late now. It doesn't really make a difference. Let's see what's going to happen. And it looks like The Fiend's going to pull this one off. That could happen. I probably see that happening. I don't know what's going to happen to Randy Orton afterward, though. All right, next we got Kevin Owens versus Sami Zayn in a rivalry match. 
but this one will actually be really good. I love seeing them fight. Let's see what happens. And it looks like Kevin Owens pulled this one off. I, I could probably see that happening. Sami Zayn too, he, he could pull something off. You never know. All right, next we have Sheamus versus Matt Riddle for the United States Championship. He actually just goes by Riddle now. I, I don't think they call him Matt Riddle anymore. In the next uh, WWE 2K game, which should have an announcement probably today or tomorrow. I can't wait for that one. But yeah, let's see what happens between Sheamus and Matt Riddle. And it looks like Riddle pulled this one off. It's possible he could pull it off. This is a good WrestleMania. They picked some really good matches that you really don't know which way it's going to go. Uh, if Sheamus gets the U.S. title, I think that would be really good, too. I really like Sheamus. All right, next we have Apollo Crews versus Big E. Now, Apollo Crews changed his gimmick recently where he's Nigerian, and I think it actually works for him. And I think that Apollo Crews is going to pull this one off. I would love for Big E to retain the title, but I think it's Apollo Crews' time to shine. Let's see what happens. Oh, and it looks like Big E retains the title. Who knows? Apollo Crews could get a rematch sometime down the line. All right, next we got Rhea Ripley versus Asuka for the WWE Women's Championship. Now, this one, I think Asuka's going to pull this one off just for the simple fact that Rhea Ripley's brand new to Raw. She is really good, but I just don't see this happening for her. I think Asuka's going to pull this one off, but let's see what the game has to say. Yeah, the game agrees with me. Um, everyone thinks that Asuka's going to win this one. All right, now we're going to check out the triple threat match. Edge versus Daniel Bryan versus Roman Reigns. This is going to be an awesome match. I cannot wait to see what happens. I really am rooting for Edge in this one, but I won't be disappointed with anyone who wins the title. So let's see what happens. Now, I don't have control of any of this. I'm just letting the computer play itself on Legend difficulty, and we're, we'll see what happens. Oh, Edge is really taking control. Oh, Roman Reigns reverses. Oh, clothesline to Edge. Oh, Roman's going to go for a pin. Let's see what happens. No, oh, only one count. It's too early to pin Edge. Roman Reigns. Oh, Roman going for another pin. He's not going to get it, though. It's too early. Roman's really overpowering Brian here. He might go for a pin here in a second. Oh, he's going for it. No, maybe not. Oh, Edge with the spear. Is he gonna get it? One, two, oh man. This is awesome. This is awesome. <laughs> oh, Roman, he just going for the pen. Roman's probably got it. One, two, three. Roman Reigns retains the title after kicking Daniel Bryan in the head. Let's look at the replay here. This is when Roman went for the pin that one time. This is when Daniel Bryan went for the pin that one time. This is when Roman went for that other pin that other time. This is when Edge went for that one pin after that spear that one time. And there's Roman kicking Daniel in the head. I love how the highlights are always just pins that took place after everything's already happened. It's pretty funny. But it looks like Roman Reigns is retaining the universal title. Not that one though, the blue one. All right, I created the Lana and Naomi versus Shayna Baszler and Nia Jax match. We're just gonna hit the simulate button and see what happens. So it looks like Nia Jax and Shayna Baszler are going to retain their tag team titles according to the game. I personally think that if Naomi and Lana were to be the ones to face Shayna Baszler and Nia Jax, they could probably do something to pull it off, even though they don't really have the strength. They could pull it off through some other means. It is WrestleMania after all. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. If you did, give it a like, subscribe. I hope you guys also enjoy the real WrestleMania. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.